guys, Murphy here. I'm back. Now, today I have Fail Fix. This is by Moose Toys, uh, the same ones that do Shopkins. And these are new dolls in which you get to give them a makeover. So they start out all messy and you have to fix them. So this is the one I have to show you guys today. Her name is Kawaii Cutie. So she has kind of like a Japanese anime look. So as you can see, her makeup's all messed up. Her hair is all crazy. She's got shoes in her hair. They come with a mask, uh, some hair ties, and a surprise outfit. So we don't even know which one she has there on the back. It shows us some of the different outfits that you can receive. The one on the far right being the most rare. There's a day, which is the most common, then sparkle and evening. So we don't know which one we're gonna get. That's pretty exciting. Um, it says on the back here, be my style savior. OMG, my kawaii look is ka what? My cutie buns are botched and my makeup is a flop. Take over my makeover, I need help. And it says here that we need to apply the magic mask, brush out the fail, style the cutie buns and reveal the fashion look. A total transformation. So it shows us over here all the different steps. All right. Let's get to unboxing. Okay, so before we finish unboxing her, now I had to cut around, yeah, I don't know exactly how this is packaged, but it is not an easy open thing. I had to cut around through the plastic on the top, so be careful that you don't cut yourself, but uh, that was enabling me not to make a huge mess of the packaging there. Here is our little insert. It says fail fix. Take over the makeover. It tells us everything that comes in it. And it looks like we've got a step-by-step -step guide here. This one shows us everything that she comes with. Okay, now step one says take a before photo. Step two, remove accessories. They're all stuck in her hair too. Then three is apply the magic mask. You press until it clicks behind the ears. Step four, you brush one strand at a time. Step five, begin at the tips, work your way up to the head. So you always wanna start at the tips, just like with your own hair. The more you brush, the better it will look. Then step six says pull away from the ear. You can reattach the fail face to play again and again. So these are dolls that you can give makeovers again and again. It's not just a one-time thing, so I like that. Step seven is showing us how to put the cutie buns in. We open up the little pom-pom clips and slide them in her hair. And then we fold over and close the clip. And finally, it says repeat with the other accessories. And then it shows us how to complete the look with the rest of the accessories, her earrings and necklace and everything. And then finally, on this last step here, it says to take an after photo after we uh, give her her makeover. And it also shows us how to put our little stand together here. I like that they come with a doll stand. It's always nice. All right, so now we know what we need to be doing. Let's go ahead and get her out and then we can follow our instructions. Okay. 
Okay. So I snipped around everything and I was able to get it out because I wanted to reveal the dress after I got her away from the packaging. So let me just adjust my camera a little bit so you guys can see this really good. All right, here she is. Are you ready to see what outfit we get? Look at that. Oh, pretty. Okay, so it's glittery. Check it out. It's all glittery on the top. I think that we got the nighttime outfit. Okay. Yes. Okay, so it says the, the sparkle outfit. Okay, we got the sparkle outfit, so not the evening. That's a different design altogether, but the sparkle outfit looks like the day one, except it's got glitter. Very cool. This is so cute. I also really like the size of these dolls. It might be hard to find some clothes for them, but it might not. I'll have to take a look and see what I got. And I'll let you guys know what fits them later on. It looks like she moves pretty well. They are pretty articulated. Her wrists move around. And okay. So it said that we should take a before photo. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we took our before photo. Now we are going to give her her makeover. Yay, this is gonna be fun. Okay, so it says step two here. We already took our picture, that was the first step. Step two, we're gonna take all the stuff out of her hair. <laughs> I wanna know, how did she manage to get shoes in her hair? Oh my goodness. Okay. They're really cute shoes though. Look, this one's got a little bow on it. You guys can see that bow on it. And let's see, she's got, she's got a little necklace in her hair. Yeah. It's got another cute little bow on it. There's little pieces of cardboard that were holding the shoes in there. And I think I found our earrings. <laughs> I've never had a doll before where I had to go through their hair for accessories. This is hilarious. Okay. These are so cute. They're like little stars and hearts. a little better. Stars and hearts. There we go. Stars and hearts. All right. Get the other one out of there. And I like they, they put them in here, but they they're not so stuck that like you have to like really wrench everything around to get to it and okay here's her little accessories and I think we're gonna have to unsnap these just my camera again here I think we're gonna have to unsnap these so that we can comb through her hair Okay, that one's kind of stuck. Oh, I see the plastic on it is a, uh, a little larger on the back. Okay, we got it. All right, I think we got all of the stuff out of her hair. And now comes the part where we have to comb through it. 
Oh my gosh, I wonder how we're gonna get through all this. Okay, but first it says to put the mask on her face and make sure that it clicks. So, let's see here. I think this is the right way. We're gonna slip it in there. I think we should go underneath her bangs there. Um, said it is to click into place, so behind her ears. There we go. Okay, that was one. There. Okay, we got it clicked in. And now we're supposed to comb through all this hair and it's showing it with a mask on, so we gotta leave the mask on so that it can work. Just like when you go to the salon yourself. If you ever had a facial done, they let it sit on your face for a while so that it can really clean your skin well. All right, so we've got our brush here. Pretty big brush, but I think they're made this way for a reason. It says fail fix on it. All right, so we're gonna start at the ends. <laughs> Wish me luck here because there is so much product. I, I'm really wondering how we're gonna get through all this, but. Oh, wow. Actually this, it's coming through pretty well. And it's not leaving a big mess. Wow, I am so surprised. I thought this would be a lot harder. Oh, wow. It And it's like not frizzy or anything either. It's nice and smooth with a nice little after curl. That is fantastic. Oh, I love that. I am super duper impressed, Moose Toys, honestly. I didn't know what to expect with this mess, but wow, it comes out so super nice. If you follow the directions, it seems like this is not as difficult as you might think. Okay. Wow. All right. And you could even like kind of mess with it to get some of the product separated there if you're having trouble with it. But this was not difficult. Like I thought it would be, honestly. So we're going to keep going here. Okay, so we've combed through her hair. Let me just my camera a little bit again. All right, we combed through her hair. It still has a nice bouncy curl to it. If you really wanted it straight, you could rinse her hair out in water with some dish soap and then rinse it out. That would get all the product out and straighten her hair out for you. You just let it air dry. I kind of like the little curl that we got going on though. All right, so we did all those steps. Now it says to reveal her face. So we gotta pull it away from the ear. All right. Goodness! Look at how cute! Looks like she's got a little factory paint right there, but that came right off. Look, she's got little sprinkles. Like, I like, she's got like ice cream and stuff on her skirt, her dress. I think that is a really, really cute accent, but she's got little sprinkles. And I'm trying to figure out what else is on there. Maybe it's just some highlighter. And then she's got 
sparkly glittery eyeshadow on. And her lip color is like a really light pink and it also has a little glitter. I don't know if that's from her eyeshadow or not. But that is really super cute. And I like how their eyes are like inset like that. It gives them some depth that's really pretty. All right. Wow, what a difference. You remember what she looked like before? All right. Well, let's keep following our instructions. Now we got to put our little kitty buns in. And there's also a little instruction on there on how to do it. But I think we're good. All right, make her some little kitty buns here. I love this. This is so cute. I like I'm a huge fan of Japanese anime and all things kawaii. So this is just such a cute doll for me. I love it. She's got her cutie buns in. Check that out. And they're fuzzy too. They're fuzzy. All right. The next step is putting all of our little accessories. She's got some hair clips and see it shows all our little hair clips in her hair there. So we'll just add those in. Got a little bow here. That right there. Okay, there's all of our little hair clips. They may not be in there very well. I'll fix them later. And then it tells us to accessorize. So we've got a little necklace there and she's got little holes for her earrings, which go perfectly with her little kawaii outfit. in there. Okay, I have to fix these. They're bugging me. Okay, that's better. <laughs> I'm a bit of a perfectionist when it comes to my dolls. Okay. Let me get her shoes on there. They have such cute little toes. All right. Now, she also came with 
these little hair ties that you can use to make all different kinds of hairstyles. But here we go. There she is all done. Look at how cute and pretty she is. We'll put her little doll stand together so that we can display her. There she is, guys. She is just adorable. And I love that you can give these dolls makeovers over and over again. It's not just a one-time thing. And there's also different looks. We got Lucky and we got a sparkly one, but there's two other different one out there that I think uh, would be really cool to collect. And there's also a bunch of other dolls in this series as well. I will be doing one on the salon doll uh, she comes with a couple different outfits and a salon chair and some hair coloring and stuff like that i will be doing that in the future so look out for that but i hope you guys enjoyed this video i'll see you next time